Um, here we go. I'm hoping for an exciting, fast-paced, full of just drama in this game. It's going to banter. There's going to be some. There's going to be booster kills. There's going to be. A, there's a sniper. It's going to. I can't wait. <laughs> here we. Here we go. Because <coughs> he starts by knocking off the fire extinguisher off the wall. Nice play. Uh, it looks like they're going for Buzka control. Let's have a look at overhead. One on the drill for uh, no sleep. Marks on Chrissy. Let's see some aggression. Let's see some aggression. Come on, boys. Come on. Come on. Come on. Freeze looks like he's uh, got vision on someone. 1v1 at the drill. 1v1 at the drill. Domus is there. Domus there. Oh, it's a strafe off. Show me the skills. And it's a kill for Domus. And that's the only kill of the map. And we're going to come back. No, I hope not. Come on. Thomas is, uh, is, is is aggression comes in his play, and it's like outside the game he's very aggressive, and he can be he implements that into the game so well with that uh, classic uh, straight line steam train that he uh, does. And that's a little nice kill for Chrissy, and and um, I don't know. Will I do EP want to win this game? Do they want to potentially die? Who said it's going to 40. So he said it's going to 40. So somebody's on the Troika inside the... Got someone on the chopper. Yeah, someone was in the chopper briefly. He's got out now. Thomas takes full damage. Thomas has got this nip. And let's have a look. We are a minute 25 in. No, he got off. He got out. <laughs> Chrissy picks up another kill. Jack, Jack gets lancered down by uh, Chrissy and it affects him quite well. Domus unfortunately misses the shot. The guy dropped just in front of him. He didn't get quite get the check on there. He's going to go for Chrissy again. He didn't learn from the first time and he got lucky again because he dropped down for the cover. John, Domus is still trying to work it. Codfather's coming up behind him. He's going to drop. That's 4-1. Oh, let's go on. Let's go on. That's so bad. Oh, God. Fru said he was bad and uh, Jack is back on the hype. I think we should really try and play to the strats here. I mean, that's another kill for uh, EP. You can't really expect uh, Jack's team to really play amazing. They are they are a on the day pickup team, and and uh, EP have been together for like three lands now. Basically, the most practice team at the event. Arguably, they are the most. That's a, that's a kill for Jack. Nice good lancer angle. Jack's got his lancer out still. He's looking for us. He's only 5 3 now. I would like to see uh, No Sleep win this map. That's a strong lancer. Strong lancer. Good angle. Pred. Pred's working. Pred's working. Could. Uh, Marks would have been prime time there. He's rolled on the knee. Oh. But I'm not I'm not seeing anybody with Marks's. I mean, this map is definitely a, a Marks's map. Yeah, you can. Someone has got a Marks'er. There's a sniper for Top Top. Codfather working it. Redding, shotgun out. Jack's got his lancer out, lancer shotgun. Pred's got his lancer out, he's inside the room, because I don't really know what it's called. The room. Everyone remember the room? Thank you. Um, Pred's working the room. And uh, Jack's looking for a little play here. Ready picks up a kill. Jack picks up another kill. Jack might be tempted to push Chrissy, but there's an angle there by Codfather, and that's a double booster. And he's very happy. Nade on. Fred on the card. Chrissy picks up another kill, this is 9-4 now, it's only, only uh, 5 kills in it, it's not, it's not too bad, but uh, Definitely I like it, yeah, EP are um, Showing no respect. definitely um, contenders for this, uh, for this tournament, it would be really good for EP if you do it, amazing for the sponsors as well if they could uh, pick that up. But uh, Codfather trying to work it, it's 10-6 now. Redding is moving around to Nades, he conveniently popped up in front of him as he got there. Tucked up on the opposite side of him, it's trying to pistol him to no avail. And... Oh god, I can definitely see a black eye after this map. Jack picks it up.
Quite an advice lane. And that's a kill for Domus. Nicely done. They're inside. Three kills now. Ten kills for EP. Seven for No Sleep. And they're all on the other side of the map. Let's uh, mix and match. Fruz is a uh, team captain, so he's got the comms up. He's got a sniper. He's, it's a Marks versus a Lancer. Domus is pushing the angle. Tucked up for support. And Pred. Frune's still alive. I don't know how Frune is still going. He's managed to get out. It's, he's still going. He's gone back. Ren's going to be taken down now as well. One kill in it. One kill in it. That's even kills. We've broken the five minute mark and it's ten kills. Each team. At least it's uh, a bit more faster paced than uh, the last map. But um, Thomas Full Red moving around. It looks like they're going to rotate to the room. Fruz is inside the room. Codfather's in the room. Tuk Tuk takes out Domus, uh, probably to save him from full red. Codfather shoots the wall. Jack gets uh, taken out by Redding. Codfather, Redding pushing up. Redding's going to push up on his own. Pulling out. He's going to regroup his team, surely. Fruz is on his own on the other side of the map. They're backing out to uh, get to Fruz, I'm sure. Chrissy drops Codfather, so uh, no kill for uh, no sleep there. Check it out. Spots are out. Are they with needs? No, they were spots. Let's have a look at the classic overhead. Two at the Bushka, one mid map, and one his own. One his own. Domus takes out the guy on his own. It's a 2v1, then he took the guy out, and he's still there. Is he moved back? Nope, he's at the end of the uh, steps, but they haven't got vision on him, so Codfather's going to uh, push around a little bit. Let's have a look how Domus is going to handle this uh, this situation. Incoming nade. Incoming nade. Domus uh, got me a bit scared then. <laughs> Here comes Domus. He's coming round. Top top. Looks like they're all regrouping. Codfire is going to make a push on the guy inside. He's gone inside room. Top top gets the uh, Puska kill. Two kills up now. This is uh, all good for the safety of EP. And there, uh, Domus drops Cod Farbar. And Domus is about to drop. Only inside two kills now. Pred drops as well. That's 14 13. Chrissy is uh, hurling the abuse at everybody but reaction. Check it out. Redding on the snipe. Redding on the snipe. We know he can work it. We saw him in that last match where he made massive, massive plays with the snipe. Do you know what? It's going to be... Is there an MVP for this tournament? So far. Is there anyone? Is there anyone really who's... I mean, yeah, we did see Rambo rack up 10k worth of points on uh, a previous domination. That's uh, arguably um, a land record. He's doing very well. EP he's now. got Snipe, he's got Snipe, ready to go work it. No, he's not. He can't really get much on it. Let's go overhead. So, at the flyer stack, there's two EP members, three EP members closed in. They need support. That's a 3v3 over there. Two people squabbling over the helipad. Here we go. Something's going to happen now. Here comes the Lancers. Fruz is going to drop, no doubt. Redding and Codfather there. They're going to make the push. No, no. They don't want to don't risk it. They go for it. Domus is on his own, still over by the helipad. The guy's backed out on his side. Are they trying to flank? Connor's getting strong Lancer on him. He's getting strong Lancers. 17 15 now. Trading kills, yeah. yeah, definitely trading kills. Strong Lancers. I mean, I would have seen more marks there, to be honest, still. But Chrissy gets a shot. 17 16. No sleep working in. That's a beautiful Red, check by Redding. That's 17 17. And uh, the fact that uh, Redding killed uh, Jack there is probably uh, sending him into uh, another dimension of aggression. Jack for the push, Pred for the push. Chrissy gets a check. That's a nice finish by Fruz. And Codfather wins the 1v. Middle, 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 middle. Middle, 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 as you can hear. Top, top, top. And Pred needs to get back in the fight. Jack's getting lancered. Pure angles. Is he going to drop? He's going to drop. Fruz in front of him. He's on the inside of the room. Codfather's pushing up. Wonderful finish by Fruz. Codfather's like, no, no, let's not go. He's running out, Fruz backing out, they're going to go claim the Bushka. Pulling at the back of Bushka, ammo crate for Codfather, that gives him another nade. Always beneficial. Chrissy is over there, but Redding picks, gets dropped by Tup Tup. Jack Reaction picks up another kill on Chrissy, and they're inside one point now. 
Can't let it come behind reaction. No? Strong spot grenades. We're going to get some decent vision. All four uh, EP members might are looking to uh, push that that side. Bit of vision. Domus with the strong lancer. Need on Yak. Nice reactions from uh, reaction. You see what I did there? Here we go. He's going to go pick up the snips. Will he get popped by the Redding Master? Master Dominator? Nope. Oh, Jack's temptation to probably stay up there then. Here we go. Climbs over the crate. He's pushing into their territory. He does not know that they're behind him. He's got people behind him. He doesn't know. He's got vision on him. Godfather's coming up behind him. Nades are in. Tuk Tuk drops to the Bushka. He's taking damage, Jack. What's he going to do? He's going to turn for the Lance Strip. Godfather with a nice hard aim. Redding picks up a kill. And the gap gets wider. Four kills now. Domus drops one. It's inside three kills. Domus is massive, massive flanking. Just ran right behind him. Right behind him. Let's have a little time limit check. What are we looking at here now? 10 minutes, 25 seconds. Looks like we're going to be going to the timer again. I don't know. Mm, there's a bit more variety in this map than uh, than streets. Because it's a nice, because it's dead closed off. It's quite easy to camp on this. Thomas is so trapped. Thomas is trapped. Yeah, he's got slapped and come off. What? I've just done it. So the time's there, it's uh, it's coming up on 11 minutes now. 11 minutes in. Inside four kills is EP with four over no sleep. Jack beats out Redding. Gets the kill. Inside three kills now. She was not to pick up the shotgun. That's a um, bold statement by uh, Reaction now. And they're on the other side of the map. That's a Lancer angle by uh, Reaction. Thomas drops Redding. Inside two kills now. We've broken the halfway point of the game in points and uh, only two kills in it and it's, as we predicted, very close. EP had just, I, ex I didn't expect this much, like, brilliance from EP. I didn't think they were that amazing when he came down and when he played in previous events. But um, he definitely uh, turned it up and judgment seems to, like, adapt, adapt it around them. Like, suits their play style perfectly. Exactly. It's, it's, it's made their game style and gameplay, like, Increased dramatically, and they've come together really strong as a team. And Jack's going to get a, get attacked here. Godfather's going to go above. Him. He's going to strong Lancer. There's a couple of people over there. Jack drops strong Buska. Another insane. That guy's chat over there. He's going to jump over the cover. Top top staying there for some reason. He's running it out there. Why are they staying there? This is just silly play by the uh, no sleep. And top top's going to get Lancer if he's going to get angled. Ruthless angle by Chrissy. Thomas has followed. Godfather's looked like he's going to go right round. Another strong lancer by Domus on the on the uh, grenades. Top top trying to work it. Codfar is just just next to him, just beneath him there. Twelve minutes twenty four. Twelve minutes and thirty seconds. Now Chris is having a bit of a cracker here. He's uh, MVP in for his team at the moment, even though uh, more points are on the other team. But uh, seven kills, one death, six assists. Let's see what's making Chrissy so good at the moment. And that's a pickup kill for Jack. Gets an insane. So Fruz drops inside two kills again. Story of the game, really. Thomas, Thomas with a nice little man to kill. 13 minutes on the clock. And we know that in 15 minutes, the uh, kill clock comes into play. If they, if Jack's team lose to that rule again, I don't, I don't know what's going to happen. But there's the only one kill in it at the moment, and he should be able to get back. Jack's got a fair few kills, and Pred and Tuk Tuk, oh, not having much ring. Two kills ahead again. One minute thirty in, and they've got certain kills ahead. That's nice. They needed that kill to come back. Pred's answer is strong. Pred's answer is strong. He's gonna drop. He's gonna get angled. That nade was poorly placed. Could have, could have got the kills. Domus is keeping his eyes on Pred. Domus is sprinting. Domus is sprinting. He's running away. Two kills in it. 15, 15, 13 minutes, 50. Gonna run into Codhead, One more minute nearly until the rule applies. Frees picks up another kill. Three kills in it now. This could go to 40. Strong lancer by Domus. Domus is gonna get aggressive here. It's coming up. Chrissy's beneath him. They're not noticed he's there. They can't really do much about it. 
tucked up sir. Everyone's together now for uh, no sleep. They're all around the booster. They're claiming that power weapon area. And we get ever closer to the 15 minute mark. 40 seconds. 40 seconds. Through's uh, pleading for his team to uh, listen to him. He's team captain. He does call most things for his team and it could be the deciding moment if somebody decides to do something else if he just listens to Fruz. Everybody needs a player that controls the team, lets them know where to go. And he's doing a good job Fruz. Captain of the tournament so far. Now the 15 minute rule is going to apply in five seconds and there's only two kills in it. And we're active. 15 minutes are on the clock now. And there's only two kill difference. He hit one. Ready with a wonderful flank. Even trade there, he couldn't have asked for anything else really for Tup Tup. And Jack supplied the uh, rule. Dom's get a strong lance, so he's going to get vision on the room. Somebody's been checked. Dom was working it. Let's move it round. Godfather. Pushing the Jack drops. Room. One more kill. One more kill. There it is. There's the here comes the kill. Will he get it? Will they win the map? No, he won't. He got a, he got to get another kill yet. You've only got there's only three kills in it. You need two. Two more kills you need. One more kill now. Not one more kill. <laughs> I thought somebody got blown up by a nade then. Well here we go. Could this reach 40 points? I don't know. Hopefully. This this is not going to be him. This is going to do devastating things to the mind of reaction if he uh, loses on that, that rule that he hates so much. And to be honest, we need that rule. If we didn't have that rule, we'd still probably be on streets now. True, probably. That's a strong need by the card. Captain Cod. He's getting angled. Getting angled. Okay, so still three kills in it. Two kills needed for EP for the win. Thankfully, the next map is a domination. Oh, that, that's what we need. Viewers. Some action for the viewers. Some, a bit more faster paced game. It could take a little bit longer. It's about 10 minutes domination games normally, depending on how intense it is. It's definitely more entertaining to watch. But again, here we are, three kills in it. Codfather's moving up. He's trying to go sneaky. Pred, don't think Pred knows that. Codfather wants it. He wanted that push. Jack's above him. Jack's got lances. He's going to get sniped. He's been checked. Will he drop? No, he won't. Codfather's taking strong damage. Moving out. Let's have a look at the red one on the Insins, two a South Ellie pad and one on the Snipes for the No Sleep team. They've got the room side of the map and EP claim the crates. <laughs> so I don't cough on you. Oh, fucking chest hurts. And there's some strong comms going on. We'll go for the overhead. Jack's there. Jack's there. Will someone drop from that name? No, they won't. He's hit. Someone's been checked. Could have been done. Could have done with a headshot there. Jack drops right in. Two kills inside again. The common scoreline. Cuffarver wants it. He spots it. Cuffarver's going for it. Top, top to drop. Top, top. Could win this 1v. Oh! That, that was a nice kill. Pred does not mess about when it comes to keeping them kills out. If he sees someone for red, he's dropping him. Chris going up behind, Jack's going to get a push behind. Domus is there with the Lancer. Domus could drop those back. Jack's there, Jack's there, it's a trade kill. So that's just one kill for EP. It's 35, 33, two kills in it. Jack's dead, Pred's there. Moving around, Chris, tucked up together, they're pairing up. Now they're going to get angled out, tucked up and tucked up and Pred are going to get angled out ruthlessly. They're going to get ruthlessly angled out here, this is not good. Not good, that's two kills drop. 34. Need one more kill. Good play by Domus to keep his team in there. So it's three kills in it. As you can hear, he hit him. Jack drops, he's four kills in it. There's only one kill left, that's it. Game's over. It was 39 34. The game's already finished. He just went 34 39. Game's over. Game's over, but we're going to keep going apparently. The rule does not count anymore because 
Yeah. Well, once it goes past 35, the rule. What is that? Is that? A, is that? So Jen? So I was told earlier. The game's over, but the the, the playing on. So if they if EP aren't bothered, then yeah, then we'll leave him to it. So yeah, back to the rig for one kill. Yeah, Chris behind Thomas. Strong Lucas. Now this will be a bit uh, hilarious if uh, Jackson managed to pull it back after uh, dodging the rule. But as we know, they're not a fan of the rule. The rule. The That's rule. <laughs> The rule that we do not speak of, or it may cause certain gamers migraines. We're not, we're not playing, we're out. <laughs> and see over there. No, we're not playing. Oh, get NTC. Do you want to rally the troops? God's sake, we're in a bit of a land dilemma here. Melo's come over to try and instigate the uh, speed of the of the games, but yeah, short equipment because because everybody's budget in the uh, Gal community, everybody lends each other's headsets and pads, and even though we've only got we've got two stations, we only occupy one. And we've got about eight sets of mix amps. Yeah, we have. And yeah. So Melo's giving giving hopes to low down on how we need to get these games played. Um, unfortunately, this game, they're going to lose out on headsets if um, NTC are forced to play this game now. But, back to the game and stop from the outside drama and still just one kill needed to win the game again. Because of the rule that we do not speak of was applied. Why don't you get your headsets back off from after this map? Yeah, you got to after this map, basically. But even practically refusing to play before because they did the headsets. Yeah, there's so much. There's a problem because we run out of time, so otherwise. We what time are we closing? Uh, this needs to finish about half 11 at the latest. It's 6 now, but as soon as the delays are past, yeah. it's going to quit. If we don't want it like, we don't want to be in the semi final when it gets 11 and be like, what the fuck are we doing? You know what I mean? Oh, I don't know, the only way I can see round it going quicker is if we took TDM out. It's gone, it's gone. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, but 15, 15 minutes though. It's too slow paced, like it gets like this, it's just it's just ruthless one kill in it, and it's just this spin lights for like 10 minutes. Got a bit of a camp fest. 